Try to put aside all your thoughts, all your worries. Give the mind a place to rest, because the mind needs to rest. It's being bombarded by the world all the time, and it's got to fight all kinds of issues. So it needs time to rest and gain its strength, and this is what the meditation does. It gives you a place to rest, to heal, to gain your strength, and to remind yourself of the things that will keep your mind strong all the way through the day. The conviction that what you do does make a difference, so you do have to be careful about your actions. And you also don't get upset when you do something good and the results are not good immediately. You have to realize that okay, it takes time sometimes for the results to come. So you just keep on doing good. That's persistence. That's the quality that you stick with. Stick with this again and again. You learn how to give yourself encouragement. You learn how to give yourself reminders of why this is a good path. And of course you have to be mindful to keep all these things in mind. And when you do, the mind can finally settle down, have a sense of being centered even as you go through the day. After all, there are a lot of things where the mind runs around unnecessarily, placing extra burdens on itself that are really not needed at all. But you can stay with the breath and make the breath comfortable, and it's a good place to settle in. And that's food for the mind. And when the mind is settled in and it's well nourished like this, then it sees things a lot more clearly. That's your discernment. So these are the things that keep you strong as you go through the day. It's good to keep them in mind, but it's also good to find time every now and then just to stop, take a few breaths, get the mind settled, so it's not running around with its thoughts and worries all the time. It's got a better place to stay, a more healing nourishing place to stay inside. So protect this spot that you have inside where you can see things a lot more clearly, because it helps you avoid a lot of unnecessary conflict out in the world. As I said, we're bombarded all the time, but we don't have to be. We can let a lot of things go past. Pay attention only to things that are really worthy of attention, things that would lead to your well-being. things that will make a difference. And that way you save yourself a lot of wasted energy, and then you can use that energy to something that's really useful. This is how you take care of the mind.